Yeah, guy, I just read something that really made me happy about Halo 4. So apparently 343 has been answering some questions and clarifying on some of the new controversial issues or items that have been leaked in the Game Informer magazine about Halo 4 that some of us aren't too happy about. The topics are instant respawns, foreigner vision, and random weapon spawns. So when he's talking about random weapon spawns, O'Connor says that the weapon drops are not random like some people thought they were. They are telegraphed and in some ways predictable. There is a variation, however. Mapping, map control will be a key, and yes, changed. Custom games will be heavily customizable. Initial playlists will be clean and focused. Players will not be represented with stacks of lists, but there will be a variety of different tastes. So basically, I think what that means is that they won't just randomly spawn around the map. It will be like somewhat of like a teamwork type of thing where like you find out where like it's going to drop and everyone goes over there to fight instead of just walking around on maps picking up weapons it's not going to be random it's going to it's still going to keep the skill and knowing of the maps to get to these weapons faster so then he talks about foreigner vision and it's initially an armor ability that lets you see through walls that said on the game form article and frank o'connor didn't really say how it really worked out but he did say he did rule out a couple ways that it could work so it's not like the uav in call of duty it's he says, I imagine a competitive player with good situation awareness would try it once and eschew it for something else. So what I th And he also writes, you cannot use foreigner vision to see players anywhere on the map. Absolutely not. So O'Connor basically just ruled that out, ruled out a lot of what we've been thinking. So it's not really one of those noob things that that's just going to be there to annoy us. It's going to be one of those things where it's going to kind of work. It's going to give you like awareness of where the person is but possibly not something that'll just go overboard. And then he talks about instant response. So by th a post by the 343 Industries, David Ellis writes on NeoGAF saying, the instant response so far will be in a uh, free-for-all mode called Regicide, one of, the new th one of the new games that 343 is going to put in Halo 4. It's not going to be in objective-type matches, which which really clears up some of the air on that, because I, I was a little ticked that it would affect capture the flag type games and just ruin the gameplay but apparently it's only for free for all so far so yeah so these 343 just cleared up some of the information and <laughs> it's good news for me i guess cuz i wasn't very happy with some of the old stuff but still more to hear about spartan ops and um and spartan points and that kind of stuff but so far i'm i'm liking this Alright guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you later.